This is one of the craziest, weirdest, most unbelievable stats in NBA history or curses, maybe you want to call them. I do call it a curse and a streak. Chris Paul, before last night, was 0-14 in his NBA playoff career when Scott Foster was refing. Now, it's not usually the matchup we talk about, a ref versus a player, but this thing's real. You've seen a lot of animosity between Chris Paul and Scott Foster throughout the years. And when I say this man is 0-14, we're not talking about 0-3, 0-4, 0-5, 0-14. Chris Paul is a guy who's been in NBA Finals in recent years, a lot of Western Conference Finals with the Rockets. He's been through a lot of basketball, and to go 0-14 over his last 14 games in the playoffs with this guy refing, there's got to be something to it. And you saw Chris Paul. You know Chris Paul last night knew this was a real streak. You saw him holding up the prayer hands, telling Scott Foster, please, please. I don't know what he was begging for, but I think he knows that this man does not like to give him help, and he was just begging for something. Please help me for once. But I was glad to see Chris Paul finally break through this, beating the Clippers last night, him, Devin Booker, Kevin Durant, the whole squad, got past the Scott Foster game and tied up a series 1-1. But this is always going to be crazy to me. We're talking to dating back to March 9th, 2014, when he lost to the Thunder, was one of his losses against Scott Foster. He's lost games to Scott Foster in the playoffs in 2015, 16, 17, 18, 19, 2020, 2021, and 2022 last year. This was in 2023, the first time they've played against Scott Foster, and he finally got his win. Maybe Chris Paul is going to break some other streaks. Maybe win an NBA championship this time. I know he's not the top guy anymore, but they have Kevin Durant and Devin Booker. It would be pretty cool to see him win. But to me, this is one of the coolest stories of the year because he finally broke the streak. And before you sit in my comments that I said 14 games, it might be 13. I've seen four or five different reliable people tweet 14 13. I don't have the technology. I don't know how to look it up on the internet. I've tried multiple times and I've seen too many sources. Some say 13, some say 14 losses. But the point is the streak is finally broken. Maybe this was the 14th game is what some meant, but it's over. 13 or 14 straight games in the NBA playoffs against Scott Foster. Chris Ball finally, and yes, finally breaks the streak. I'm rooting for the Suns. I live in Phoenix. Who's with me?